Dad, this is your day. Lieutenant Leroy Bowman, this is your day. Thank God for you. Thank God for your service and your sacrifice and what you've meant in everybody's life, especially mine. Beautiful Sumter, South Carolina today at our Veterans Park and just finished up a dedication of, of the Red Tail P-51 Mustang uh, that's behind me, just a, what the Tuskegee Airmen flew back in World War II. So we were just here honoring and dedicating that plane and honoring the service of those great men back then. I just think it's special. I just think it really highlights the achievements of our African-American citizens in Sumter and obviously Tuskegee Airmen across the country. It's just incredible, as, as General Brown talked about in his remarks, the challenges that they faced I, you know, I, I never even thought about it, how he said it was a mission that was set up to fail and how the Tuskegee Airmen proved them all wrong and were just vital assets in, in World War II, just escorting bombers and going on missions. And it's just incredible history. And I just think it's no, a better time. It's no better time than now. And uh, we're just excited that it worked out, that the chairman of the Joint Chief of Staff could come and just be a part of that. This is the Airmen that started a journey before there was a path, before there was anyone ahead to look to. They paved the way to change America. This P-51 behind us, uh, behind me, stands as a uh, visual memorial to the legacy of the Red Tails, the Tuskegee Airmen, and the contributions of the men and women from South Carolina. For African Americans in the military, it's it's always been a challenge for us, even back during the times from World War One, World War Two, even when I came in in 1969. We've always had to prove that we were better just to be considered equal. The inspiration of the Tuskegee Airmen is an example of that. I've had to do it, my children have had to do it, and others that are here today. General Brown, he had to do it as well. We had to prove to the world that not only could we do the job, but we could do it as well as anyone. And we have done it, we are doing it, and continue to do it. It's a great day to remember the service and sacrifice of all the Tuskegee Airmen, especially those from Sumter, Leroy Bowman and Willie Ashley. This day is clearly a reflection of the love that this community has for him and for his service. And for that, we are deeply indebted to all of you and to the entire city of Sumter, especially to the chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff, General Brown, to come here and be here for this day.